with the end of the five years term of office of the fourth East African Legislative Assembly, the race for the top position of Speaker of the House is up for grabs. This morning, aspirants for the position were nominated to vie for the position. Burundi has presented Joseph Nakarutimana, one of the longest serving legislators and Deputy Secretary General of the ruling party. I'm a candidate because I feel I can do it. I've been a member of parliament for 30 years now, about 30 years. South Sudanese Guy Deng was the first candidate to tender in her nomination papers to the office of the clerk at the Arusha Base Assembly in Tanzania. What am I going to do? One of the most important things is strengthening our cooperation with the other organs within the institution, such as the Council of Ministers, the Summit and the Secretariat. However, two aspirants from South Sudan, Gideon Gatpan and Kennedy Mukuria, stepped down from the race in favor of Dr. Anna Ito. They claim President Sarvakil has directed them to support Dr. Anna Ito. I want to put the interests of the country first before mine, and I therefore want to declare that I've stepped down in the office of the speakership as a contestant, allowing the official candidate of the country to run for the speakership position in the fifth year. We have received a directive from the president of South Sudan indicating that we should rally behind Dr. Ann Ito for the speakership of the East African Legislative Assembly. In respect to my country's decision and also uh, giving respect and support to my uh, colleague and friend, Honorable Dr. Anito, I stepped aside and I withdrawn my application. However, Guy Deng insists she is the best candidate who will champion the interests of the East Africans. I am the best candidate. I am um, articulate, I'm clear in my mind as to what I want to do. I'm good in terms of working with the various um, uh, uh, people, uh, various uh, organs. The failure by South Sudanese to agree on a single candidate has sucked in the South Sudanese second deputy speaker to resolve the matter. The election of the 50th speaker of the East African Legislative Assembly is expected to take place on Tuesday, with the winner expected to gather 43 votes in the first round. If he or she fails, the last candidate of the expected three will be knocked off so that the contest is determined between the two remaining candidates. All the newly elected members from the Patanases have been registered today ahead of their swearing in tomorrow. Martin Ngoga is the outgoing Speaker of the Assembly. Jingo Francis, NTV, in Arusha, Tanzania.